Today we celebrate St. Sylvia's Day here at Winchester Cathedral. Sylvia's name is Old English with Hun meaning strong bear cub. So who was St. Sylvia? Well, St. Sylvia was an Anglo Saxon, an incredibly important figure here in Winchester and the Old Minster. So much so that the full name of this Norman cathedral is the Cathedral Church of the Holy Trinity, St. Peter, St. Paul, and St. Swithin. Winchester born, St. Swithin was ordained as the 18th Bishop of Winchester in the year 852, and he also served as counsellor to Kings Egbert and Athelwald during his life. Little was reliably known about St. Swithin, but what's really well recorded is his charismatic personality. He had a great impact on those who served him and who he served as well. And that meant that when he passed away, his grave became an incredibly important place of pilgrimage. So joining me now in the east end of Winchester Cathedral, and here we see the modern shrine marker for St. Swithin. Now this was built in 1962, which was a thousand years since St. Swithin's death. There's some really lovely details in this. For example, here you'll notice the broken eggshells. Well, the only record of a miracle that was said to have taken place in Swithin's lifetime occurred on the bridge that he had built. A woman dropped her basket of eggs on the way to the market, breaking them all, and St. Swithin picked up the eggs and returned them to her, fully restored, hence these broken eggshells on the memorial. And on the fabric here we see some raindrops. Now this is because St. Swithin is most widely known for his association with rain. Legend suggests that Swithin was so dismayed at his translation from a humble grave, which was his request, to the high altar in the Old Minster, that 40 days of rain ensued. The legend has grown over the centuries, possibly due to the mistranslation of Wolfstan's poem mentioned here, whereby it is thought that if it rains on the 15th of July, we could be in store for 40 days of rain. And lastly here we see some apple trees. Now this is due to the strong association between St Swithin and apples, as an old saying claims that if it rains on St Swithin's day, it is a saint blessing the apples, because it is true that if there was rain in the middle of July, it would harvest very large apples. I hope you've enjoyed this brief video about St Swithin, and if you have any facts of your own that you'd like to share, please comment below.